but as we load up the first game in this test in Smash Hit, the Galaxy S6 with its octa-core processor just powers through to take the lead as we move on to Temple Run 2. With the Galaxy S6 further increasing its lead as it finishes up Temple Run 2, the 1M9 and iPhone 6 are neck and neck with the iPhone 6 just barely edging it out as it moves on to Photoshop Touch. So at this point, all three phones are about an app apart from each other with the 1M9 and last working on Score Mobile, the iPhone 6 and second getting started with Netflix, and the Galaxy S6 in the lead already on the browser test loading CNN.com. But fortunately for the iPhone 6 and 1M9, we're just finishing up with the first lap of this test, so there still is time to make a comeback in the second lap where we test each phone's multitasking abilities. The iPhone 6 finishes the first lap 7 seconds after the Galaxy S6 at 1 minute exactly, with the 1M9 finishing 6 seconds after that at 1 minute and 6. So, so far, the Galaxy S6 has had to reload both Smash It and Temple Run 2, which leaves the door open for the other two phones to make a comeback. And actually, the 1M9 has had every single app ready to go in the background, with it just flying through this second lap, overtaking the Galaxy S6 and finishing with a total time of 1 minute and 27 seconds. The iPhone 6, having most of its apps ready to go in the background, also passes the S6 with a time of 1 minute and 34, and now the S6 finishes with a time of 1 minute and 37. Okay, so those were very interesting results. The phone that finished the entire test first was the 1M9, even though it actually took the longest to finish the first lab. The phone that finished the test last was the Galaxy S6, even though it was actually the quickest to finish the first lab. So take what you want from these results. If you want a phone that finishes loading a single app the fastest, go with the Galaxy S6. If you want a phone that offers the smoothest multitasking, go with the HTC One M9. And if you want something that falls somewhere in between, go with the iPhone 6. But that about does it for me in this video. Thank you guys for watching and as always, I'll see you in the very